light is it's it's the coolest thing period so you are more like a plant than you ever thought so a plant needs the sun for photosynthesis okay it's going to convert light into energy and without the sun most plants die off Hello and welcome back to another episode of the Thrive State Podcast. I'm your host, Dr. Tian Vu, aka Dr. V, Triple Board Certified MD and Performance and Longevity Expert. And on today's episode, we dive deep into the science of health. Are you ready for a world-class download of the science of wellness? And do you want to learn how to actually optimize your body and learn how to live longer and a healthier life? you're going to want to listen to this episode because we actually dive into the science of actually harnessing the energies of the earth. You know, if you've been following me for a while, you would understand that disease as we have today is really because we have deviated from living a life we're meant to live as human beings. You know, our DNA is telling us we need a certain amount of sleep. We need good nutrition. Our DNA is telling us we need to move every day that we should be in states of gratitude and joy and not stressed out all the time. Our DNA is telling us that we need to be in social relationships that are nurturing. It's telling us that we need to be focusing our thoughts on the present and thoughts that actually empower us rather than thoughts that bring us back. And finally, our DNA is calling for us to live our purpose. But, you know, with modern life with refrigeration to modern conveniences to tall buildings to to bad lights we're not really living the way our dna is telling us to live we're actually deviating from the life human beings are meant to live and yes some of this has to do with technology and the way technology is using us and we're not using it but can we also reverse the tides can we also tap into technology to actually augment the natural ways we've been living or well, yes and on today's episode we talk about just that there are three things that our bodies normally interact with on a moment-to-moment basis that actually allow us to thrive magnetism oxygen and light and on this podcast episode we talk about the biohacking techniques and technologies that are out there that actually bring these natural things into our body to help us heal, to help us rejuvenate, to help us reach our optimal selves. Ladies and gentlemen, on this podcast, I introduce to you the CEO of Da Vinci Medical, Jason Tabot. I met him a few months ago, and this guy is really a pioneer when it comes to technology and the interface of technology and wellness and health. He's the creator of the superhuman protocol, which we'll learn about in this podcast. We actually talk about how different natural elements can actually be augmented with technology to help us improve our health and reach the next state of optimal performance. The superhuman protocol combines what we already know about our bodies and the natural energies of earth, wind, and fire, and combines them with actually state-of-the-art scientific wellness practices including pulse electromagnetic therapy, or PEMF, exercise with oxygen therapy, or EWOT, and finally, photobiomodulation. Learn about all these technologies, learn about why it's synergistic effect when you use them in a particular order, and learn how you can recharge, rejuvenate, become a superhuman yourself after listening to this podcast. So, And so without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, Please welcome Jason Tabot. So essentially, we're just bringing your blood flow back to normal. And for most people, to bring it back to normal is superhuman because it's been so abnormal and dysfunctional for so long, and they've accepted it. Okay, so that's that's the grounding or earthing. So we should be walking around barefoot 30, 40 minutes a day. Well, not everyone can do that. Not anyone has time. Not everyone has time. It's not safe and, it, and it's not practical in many cases. And so when you lay on our, our pure wave, PEMI, P-E-M-I, you would lay on that for eight minutes, all five liters of blood get charged. Every cell separates. And now all five liters of blood 
fertilizes your 11 organ systems. And now all those symptoms that you had start to go away because many of these symptoms are lack of blood flow. And, you'll, and I know you'll agree with, agree with me here. It's either toxicity and or deficiency in some building block, right? Nutrients, vitamins, minerals, et cetera. Well, if you're getting them into the diet, but the delivery system, AKA blood is impeded, how do you expect the 50 bucks or a hundred bucks or the $400 a month in supplements that you're consuming are actually getting utilized? So when you do the PEMF or even grounding, walking around barefoot, all of those pills you're taking or any IV therapy that you do, any of these high-end nutrients, they get absorbed. The bioavailability, the uptake, the utilization is maximized. Mm. So just that one device alkalizes the blood, opens up the oxygen transport doors to all those red blood cells. And now your body is ready to absorb oxygen. That's when we go into stage two, which is exercise with oxygen. In oxygen therapy, exercise with oxygen, you're exercising while you're breathing. If your CO2 levels are up, so are your O2 levels, right? So we're earning what we're bringing in and we're exhaling what uh, is in balance. So you also have to look at oxygen as an antidote. Oxygen, if you were to put any particular pathogen in a Petri dish in a lab and you raise the O2 levels, you'll watch some of those go into apoptosis. That's programmed cell death. They'll, they'll kill themselves off. Most of those viruses and bacteria are anaerobic. They don't like oxygen. You know, I'm, I'm not saying everybody needs to go do oxygen therapy, I, but we are not getting enough oxygen to enough of our red blood cells to enough of the body because of the narrowed microvessels. I mean, there's a whole slew of things that are affecting the quote architecture or infrastructure of the body. All we're doing is bringing those back to normal. And, and one 15 minute session of that oxygen therapy is again, it's a, you don't need, you don't need to do it every single day. Some people do, but it, it has a long-term durable effect. Light is it's, it's the coolest thing, period. So you are more like a plant than you ever thought. So a plant needs the sun for photosynthesis, okay? It's going to convert light into energy. And without the sun, most plants die off, right? You're either growing or you're dying, right? And we as humans, we're either growing or we're dying. And most of us, we're dying. We're aging very rapidly. In my opinion, you know, living to 80 or 90, we should be going twice as far as that, but we're, we're, we're aging very quickly. You are supposed to be getting light just like a plant. And if everyone's like, what are you talking about? We have actual absorption sites in the body. We have chromophores that are meant to absorb light. Yes, we are like a plant and we are what? Blocking the light with buildings, clothing, sunscreen. And this episode of the Thrive State Podcast is brought to you by the Thrive State Accelerator. The Thrive State Accelerator is actually a home course that I developed using the exact same techniques I work with my celebrity clients, CEOs, and executives on how to get them to the Thrive State. The Thrive State Accelerator teaches you how to master your seven bioenergetic elements. That's sleep, nutrition, movement, stress and emotional mastery, relationships, our thoughts and mindset, as well as purpose. In this Thrive State Accelerator, you're also gonna get a bonus module on optimization. That's how I talk about supplementation, peptides, all the optimization techniques I use with my clients to get them to the Thrive State. Now, for some of you who are just joining us for the first time, you guys might be wondering, what is the Thrive State? Well, the Thrive State is actually the energy the epigenetic environment we give to ourselves, telling ourselves, telling our DNA how to act and how to respond. And if we want optimal health, longevity, and peak performance, if we can master these seven bioenergetic elements, our ability to have those three things that we just said, optimal health, longevity, and peak performance is at its greatest. And it also prevents you from getting chronic symptoms like brain fog, being overweight, feeling sluggish, acne, pain, all these chronic symptoms, as well as preventing you from getting chronic disease. 
So getting to that thrive state is really getting to that state to master being that very best version of yourself so you could show up for you, for your family, for your business, everything that's important to you. So go ahead, check it out right now at kianboo.com slash accelerator and use coupon code podcast25 for 25% off. Now back to the podcast. We improved cell, we opened up cell space, cell surface space for more light to be absorbed by more cells. So bottom line is alkalizing and separating red blood cells first to open up the oxygen transport doors. Then we do oxygen. We flood the body with oxygen. Then we do light. And then light goes, wow, I'm getting absorbed by a lot more cells. And when the free radicals kicked out, there's plenty of oxygen to come back in and make ATP. And so that's why we do this exact order, right? These are, these are Earth's elements. We're just putting them together in magnitude order in the correct order to restore order. Here is a lot of, you know, healing through these technologies and, and certainly, you know, really in the health space, knowing all this stuff. But my last question to you is this, what has been your best medicine? My wife. Oh, beautiful. Yeah. She keeps me on track and, you know, we are, we are running at Mach 5 here. And because we want to serve so many people, we want to make a, we want to put a dent in the universe. And that doesn't happen working an eight hour day. It doesn't even happen working a 12 hour day. Yeah. It happens working 15, 16, 17 hours a day, seven days a week. And some of my team keeps up with me. Okay. And if it wasn't for my wife to keep me in line, get, get me to the beach once in a while, spend some <laughs> time with her, help, help understand with, What's really important here, because without my health, I don't have a company. Without my health, I don't have any wealth, right? So it's really easy for me because it's exciting to watch people's lives change. It becomes addicting to stick to this. Yeah. And if it, yeah, I, my wife, Svetlana, um, there's, there's no better person in the universe uh, to share this experience and this endeavor with me. And I would not be here if it wasn't for her. So big, big shout out to my wife. If you enjoyed those highlights, from this week's episode of the Thrive State Podcast. If you want to check out the full episode, go to Apple iTunes, Spotify, or wherever podcasts are heard. Now, if this podcast has given you value, you could really support us by giving us a five-star review at ratethispodcast.com slash Thrive State. Also, if you haven't already picked up a copy of my book, Thrive State, you can get free, free chapters if you go to Thrive State Book. Dot com. And if you love the content, you want to go a little bit deeper with me and my team, take the Thrive State Accelerator. It's the exact program I use to get my clients into the Thrive State. That's kianvu.com slash accelerator and use the coupon code podcast25 for 25% off. Thank you again for being a part of this journey and for listening to these podcast highlights. Get more content on my YouTube, Instagram, TikTok, and LinkedIn at Kianvu MD. Don't forget to follow, like, and subscribe. And remember always, you are your best medicine.